Hey YouTube, it's Audrey, and I wanted to do a share. As a lot of you know, this past weekend, Tamika, who scrapped the world here on YouTube, came and hung out with me, and we just had a great time. Tamika, I miss you already. We had so much fun, and thank you so much for coming. Can't wait to see you again. We just, um, you know, spent time. We went shopping. We had lunch. We took a class at um, one of our local scrapbooking stores that had Frank Garcia from Prima there. And then the next day we just hung out and crafted and did some projects and talked and listened to music. So it was really a good time and I really appreciate her coming. And of course, Tamika being the class act that she is, she came bearing gifts, even though I said not to bring gifts, but she did anyway. And I'm not going to say that I did not appreciate it. So thank you, girl, even though I gave you a hard time. But um, this is the card that she made for me. And of course, it's beautiful as all of hers are. So um, I just want to share this. I really like it. Really like the colors, the papers. And then she wrote me a wonderful note inside. She also gave me one of her sewing machine kits that she had made up and was selling. And I totally appreciate that because I totally am a sewer. So I'm going to put that together, make a cute little mini. And then she knows that I love animal print paper. And so she brought me tons of animal print paper in different colors and different prints. And in different sizes. This is like 8 by 8 size. And then she also brought me um, some 12 by 12s. So I am hooked up for some animal print paper. Woo! <laughs> I had to come up with some good projects for this. So I was happy to get all of that. But then she did not stop there. No, she did not. She made a handmade item. And she made this lovely 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 box girl's gonna make me like shabby chic eventually yes she is because i have not really i'm i guess i'm more of a clean clean no frills kind of designer in some ways i mean i love bling don't get me wrong we put a lot of bling on there we like animal print but i'm not one that is necessarily um that that necessarily does the shabby chic design. I like it, but it's just that I really don't do it. Well, Tamika has made this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful box with the letter A for Audrey. Woohoo! So, um, <laughs> I'm being silly, just got home from work, so a little wound up. But anyway, um, this is the beautiful box she made. And take a look at the flowers and the detail that she added there's bling there's um different kinds of flowers there's um little acrylic flowers like there and then she added little centers to some of the flowers and then more bling she added a handle that she whitewashed and she distressed edges and layered paper and just made it gorgeous and she added the trim and she added a charm that is so cute look at that perfume bottle i just love that and then there's um things on the back side and then that's the back view view and then it just opens up and she whitewashed the inside but then inside she made me some handmade goodies look at those felt flowers they look better than the ones that are in the michael's dollar bin i love these and she added stamens packaged them up really beautifully and then also she altered some clothes pins. Look at that. Look at those. They're just gorgeous. And she stickled the flowers. She added some 
um, lace pieces and flowers and stamen pearls. Just thought I'm going to keep. Look at that. So, yep, she definitely has me on the shabby chic route. And then we went to, as I said, the class at Prima, and we made another box. So, I am going to have to show you that, too. But anyway, thank you so much, Tamika. And yes, this box has earned a spot of honor in my craft room. So, next time you come back, you'll see it there. Thanks, guys, for watching. And you guys have a great and very, very blessed day. Bye-bye.